Achtung! By direct order of Death's Head, the delivery of wear related equipment takes priority over standard supplies. Wear related ordnance is to be immediately delivered to the mid-section hangars. Containers marked restricted should be moved to the high security area in the forward section. A guest of mine will be arriving shortly. I want him to be escorted immediately to the forward section of the Zeppelin. My associate and I will be waiting for him there. Do not make me wait a second longer than necessary. I want your best security detail to guard the top secret equipment in the forward section of the Zeppelin. Under no circumstances is this experimental machinery to come to harm. The team who has guarded it at the hospital failed in their mission. I am quite certain you don't want your men to suffer their fate. Remind your men that smoking is prohibited in restricted areas such as the gun ammunition platforms and upper flight decks. Need I remind you that a number of flammable materials are stored in both sections. Contact with even a spark could result in extensive damage and loss of life.
much to thank you for, Herr Doctor. Without you, we never would have known where to excavate for the portal. My information is always correct. Did I not tell you the American would be at the train station? And where you could trap Caroline Becker? Very true. But I still have my doubts about your latest data on the portal. How can we be certain it will remain active? I assure you, my students properly translated those dual manuscripts. The portal will work. <laughs> ah, yes, your students. Weren't they even vaguely suspicious about your true intentions? That you drag them to Eisenstadt to translate the Thule manuscripts for the Third Reich? No, Blaskowitz kept everyone so focused on his antics. No one had time to think of much else. The Golden Dawn has no idea I work with you. You work for me, Doctor. Not with me. As you wish. But please, let us pass through into the Black Sun dimension. I wish to see it and be redeemed after a lifetime of ridicule. I'm sorry, Doctor, but you're taking a different journey. Auf Wiedersehen. <laughs> Come with me. The weapon will be firing soon. I appreciate your concern, Doctor. You have nothing to worry about. My men are well aware of the dangers of flammable materials and will smoke a safe distance away from them. Perhaps you should stick to your test tubes and allow the real men to deal with the fighting of the war. Their related ordnance and energy storage barrels should not be stored in standard weapons lockers. Access to such items and weapons are restricted. Transfer any such items to the appropriate high security areas immediately.
Once we have successfully test-fired the weapon and destroyed Eisenstadt, coordinate all remaining Luftwaffe to eliminate the remaining Allied aircraft. Then set a course for London. This day marks the beginning of the end for the Allies. Due to a supply problem, there are a limited number of parachutes on board the Zeppelin. While I realize we will never need them, I would recommend another requisition be sent immediately. Things that are never supposed to happen have a way of becoming reality. I would also appreciate my concern not being brought to the attention of Death's Head. emphasize the importance of closely monitoring the Black Sun power siphoning devices. An energy spike could cause an overload that would transmit from the Black Sun realm through the portal artifact, creating an uncontrollable and massive power surge. An overload of this magnitude would be catastrophic to the Zeppelin. the Zeppelin, and I overheard Dr. Alexandrov talking to Death's Head. Alexandrov was the mole all along. But he must have worked with Anton Krieg, because Krieg claimed to have given information to the Nazis, too. Death's Head had Alexandrov executed. Can't say I'll miss him. But now I have to follow Death's Head and Hans Gross through the Thule portal. 
and into the Black Sun. There, I'll have to stop them before they can fire that superweapon and destroy Eisenstadt. 